our web seminar today uh, on significant changes in ACI 318-19. Uh, just a couple of things before I get started in case there are <clears throat> a couple who have not attended our web seminars before. Uh, we divide each seminar into three segments. Uh, today we have two and a half hours for the seminar. So the so with, with that, I'll get started. Uh, this is how uh, ACI 318.19 looks like. Uh, those of you who have not seen it, uh, the outside is pretty similar to ACI 318.14, but inside uh, there is quite a bit of color that has been added. The, the figures and, and, and uh, uh, the figures in particular are in color. And, and there is other color on the pages. That's, that's a change that you will notice right away. Uh, I, I should uh, uh, say something at the beginning. Uh, the only time I have done this seminar on 318.19 web seminar, I did it in four uh, two-hour segments for a total of eight. This time I uh, decided that that depth uh, most engineers probably are not interested in. So I tried to squeeze the eight hours into two and a half, uh, spent at least a day doing that. And I think I still have too many slides. Uh, so I do not know how the time will work out. Uh, if need be, uh, I will skip things here and there. Uh, so th this is to tell you now so that you will not be surprised if that happens. Uh, anyway, a, a large number of substantive changes in ACI 318.19 and many of them are of far-reaching consequence. I, I mean everything I say in that line. Uh, this obviously will require significant learning and adjustment on the part of the practitioner. Uh, ACI 318.19 is, is already the reference standard in the 2021 IBC, which has been out for a while. It will be the reference standard in AC 7.22 which is in final stages of, of, of development. The 2021 IBC would be adopted by the state of California on January the 1st of 2023. I throw that in for two reasons. One is that California is about the only state that has a fixed date for adoption. California state law requires that the state code change every three years and that it incorporate the latest edition of the IBC. So January 1 of 2023 is a firm date. Uh, the second reason I throw that in is until your legal code, whether it's California building code or City of Los Angeles building code, which is California building code with modifications. Until your legal code adopts ACI, or, or I should put it another way, <laughs> until ACI 318.19 has been adopted by your legal code, you don't have to use it. So, so you have a little time to get adjusted to ACI 318.19. In view of the, the number and the nature of the changes, I believe that you will need this time. I, I think this is a good time to get started, but you will not be using uh, ACI 318.19 uh, immediately. Okay. Uh, there are jurisdictions that adopt a new edition of the IBC ahead of California. There aren't too many. And most jurisdictions actually follow California. 
I decided that it would be good to have a couple of slides to tell you about the big changes uh, as we see them in 31819. Uh, and I'll go over them quickly because uh, they will be treated in more detail later. So introduction of high strength reinforcement with yield strength up to 100 KSI. Modification of straight bar development length provisions. Modification of hooked and headed bar development length provisions. 